I'm going to talk about the topic muscles of upper limb. There are 19 muscles, 14 are inverted and by ulnar and 5 by medial nerve. All muscles of part uh, muscles of posterior compartment of arm and foramen are inverted by radial nerve. Uh, first muscle is deltoid muscle, origin, lateral part of clavicle on uh, anterior fibers, second acromion process of scapula or medial fibers, third spinal processes making superior or posterior fibers of deltoid muscle. Insertion, middle part of humerus, inversion, axillary nerve, function, attraction of arm and medial rotation of arm. It depends on fibers like interior, middle and posterior or superior. Interior fibers are flexion and lateral rotation, middle are extension and medial rotation, posterior or superior is abduction by abduction of arm. The abduction of arm, the degrees 15 to 90 is called death joint, to 0 degrees to 15 degrees it is called a supraspinoid. 90 degree to 100 degree it is called trapezius and if it is more than 100 degrees it is called serratus inferior intramuscle infection at lower half deltoid muscle is to prevent the damage of axillary limb Subjectives, today we are going to continue on the muscles of upper limb and we will talk about supraspinaceous muscle and supraspinaceous muscle when we talk about supraspinaceous muscle uh, the only one supraspinaceous muscle is from the supraspinous fossa now it is about the insertion of supraspinaceous muscle uh, which is going to the greater tubercle of humerus and the innervation of the supraspinaceous muscle is the suprascapular nerve now we will talk about the function the function of supraspinaceous muscle is it is an abduction from 0 to 15 degrees and it stabilizes the shoulder now we will talk about infraspinaceous muscle the only one of infraspinaceous muscle is from the infraspinous fossa uh, this was supraspinous and it is infraspinous now we will talk about the insertion and when you see the uh, in insertion for both supraspinous and infraspinous are same, which is going to the great tubercle of humerus. Now we will talk about the innovation. Inner innovation is also supraspinous muscle, which is also the same as the supraspinous muscle. Now we will talk about its function. Function is the lateral rotation of arm and it also stabilizes the shoulder as same as its supraspinous muscle. Myself, Jansa, and today I am going to take the continuation of muscles of upper limb. There are three more muscles, it's teres major, teres minor and subscapularis muscle. Teres major, its origination is starting from the lower lateral border of scapula. Scapula is the triangular part of shoulder. And insertion is attached at medial loop of bicipital root. Innervation is lower scapularis nerve. Function is adduction, means away. And medial rotation of arm and it stabilizes our shoulder. Teres minor. Its origin is starting from the upper lateral part of scapula. Insertion is going to the greater tubercle of humerus. Innervation is axillary nerve and it is divided into two parts, deltoid and teres minor. Function. It is a lateral rotation and it stabilizes our shoulder. Subscapularis. Its origin is starting from the subscapularis fossa. And insertion is going towards lesser tubercle of humerus. And innervation is the upper end of subscapularis nerve. And the function is medial rotation and it stabilizes our shoulder. 